<laughs> what is up everybody it is joji back with another video man i hope everybody's doing great um i got some bad news i'm, I'm gonna keep it a big big stack right here i'm a, i got some bad bad news i mean they're not terrible it doesn't affect southwest florida but it could affect you know a bunch of car games because this is a very popular car game that we're going to be going over ladies and gentlemen how y'all doing today we're going over some bad news including roblox car games i'm just going to start off with our first topic and as you guys know cars have been removed a lot of cars have been removed from this game i could go on from brand for brand i could go chevy lexus toyota honda lamborghini audi you name it so many car brands and i want to give a big shout out to blubber because if it wasn't for him i wouldn't have made this video so huge shout out to blubber link down below if y'all want to go check out his videos but the very popular game that actually got well I, I wouldn't say it got shut down you just can't play it right now uh as we could see i don't know if it's if it's fully shut down but it is midnight racing okay if you guys have ever heard of midnight racing as we can see here's blubber's video and basically right here as we can see take a look at this this is the game right here look sorry this place is currently under review try again later the game is super popular i'm sure a lot of you guys have played this game a lot of you guys watching it's kind of like a really realistic car game they had like lamborghinis and as we can see 112 million plus visits 500 000 favorites and there's literally one person active that is because they got dmca'd now if you guys don't know what that means that's basically copyright so for example let's say southwest florida kept cars that after being told they had to remove them they kept them then they would probably get a strike so that's why they have to remove certain cars like ferrari they had to remove the bmws off sale they had to remove the chevys they had to remove the lamborghinis that's because these car brands basically didn't want them using their cars anymore because they're using them without permission they're not paying them and that's why you see driving empire who's actually paying for license so they could use their cars for example look at lamborghini driving empire is a lamborghini license so they can add lamborghinis for example they have the temerari on the urus they also have audi in the game they have like a bunch of real life audis with real badges they have so many car brands apollo pagani they got porsche mclaren i could go on and on that game is growing and growing they have jaguar and it's amazing what they've done and i hope a lot of other games can do that i know obviously having a license probably does cost a lot of money but at least these cars games are adding fictional cars as you guys know we went over this before in the discord speaking of southwest florida how this could possibly affect it is it already is they're not adding real life cars anymore let's just go ahead and take a look at the southwest florida discord we can see right here they're adding fictional cars and i want to say one thing southwest florida have been doing an amazing job with their fictional models as we see in greenville they've been doing an amazing job with their fictional models and that is why these games are no longer adding real life cars because they don't want to take that chance of risking their game and getting shut down because i'm sure the community wouldn't want that you know what i'm saying why the heck would why like you know what i'm saying like these games are so fun i enjoy playing them i'm sure a lot of you guys watching this video enjoy playing them and it, it's it's it honestly sucked to see them get shut down and that is why these car games are making fictional cars and no longer adding real life cars and why they had to remove real life cars and also i want to add on there's also a chance that we could keep losing real life cars within greenville southwest florida and furthermore like you know what i'm saying just a bunch of other games that have car brands like for example ford is still in all the car games uh you still got like nissan as we can see i'm in a nissan r34 right now you still have so many car brands but it's still a good chance you could lose more but it's kind of interesting to see how ferrari apparently ferrari basically took down mrt if i'm not mistaken that's what i heard in blubber's video um once again big shout out to blubber it's just crazy to see seriously it's absolutely nuts to see this is like i think this is like one of the first major car games that actually got like shut down or dmc would strike because of the cars as you guys know we just lost these cars like in these games nothing really happened to the game except just removing them but this is what could have happened i'm not sure i will admit i'm not 100 percent sure what's been going on behind the scenes with mrt i'm not sure if maybe they were told by ferrari to take down their cars and they didn't listen maybe that's why the game got taken down i don't know i don't know i don't want to i'm not for anybody wondering i don't know why that happened i'm not sure what happened behind the scenes why just ferrari it was that i've heard but it's honestly crazy to think it's it's actually crazy to think blubber actually did an amazing job explaining some of it let's just take a look at his video now, right here so basically do 
Oh, okay. Wait. <laughs> what? Why do I look like <laughs> I look like God right now? What's with this lighting? Yo, the sun's just so shining. In. Okay, due wait. Due to the game being DMCA, the game is not even playable right now. Yeah, the but game's not playable. Ferrari did this. Well, in their other game, Project Track Day, they were advertising a new GT3 car oh, to nah. pull in players, and that was removed not long ago. And yeah, this issue, if anything, really just oh, highlights shoot. the need for games to remove real cars. Okay. Well, that I hope that clears up a little bit. Basically, another car game got removed and yeah another another car game basically lost it and then yeah for anybody wondering what the game is it's this one right here um this project track day they added a new gt3 car the gt3 car is a ferrari and it has now been removed so putting the puzzle pieces together is probably that, that that's the i don't know i don't know i don't know it's crazy it's actually crazy to think hopefully this doesn't happen anymore it kind of sucks to see this because it's it's just been going on for so long now starting like late 2022 with lamborghini and then from there it just kept on going on right now you know what i'm saying and also this is what the mrt we actually have an announcement shout out to big man they made an announcement saying hey everyone thank you for playing the game we value each and every one of you so we wanted to give you an update regarding the game's current uh, situation we are aware that the game has been put under review and we are planning to patch the game so the requirement to make it live and fulfilling again or fulfilled again in the meantime just hang tight we will notify we will notify you guys with updates thank you guys we'll be back very soon okay good news it doesn't seem like the the game is getting fully shut down but obviously right now you can't play it i don't even think i'm not even mistaken i i tried searching it up i literally couldn't find the game on roblox right now that's due to the fact you can't play it and it's you know uh just under review i guess and i'm pretty sure that's just because they got copyright strike and hopefully this happens where if they just remove the cars the game will be playable again i never really played the game i have played it before but nothing crazy it's a good game from what i've heard but i honestly have not played it too much so i can't get my opinion really on the game but i hope they can get it all sit situated and fixed because i would not want to see another game within this car community on roblox get taken down because that would, that would suck seriously like you know i like to look at it like we're all in this together all these car games we're in this together in my in my opinion but i don't know if other people agree with that so i just hate to see it i don't like to see the car brands get taken down but yeah let me know what you guys think i honestly understand why they get taken down though as you guys don't copyright they're using it without permission but hey man there's there's only so much we can do so hit that like and subscribe button let me know what you guys think do you guys think this is going to continue within other games do you think more cars are going to get removed but yeah let me know what y'all think hit that like and subscribe button and turn on that post notification bell to never miss any videos like this and also go check out this video where i show you guys me crashing a huge a crazy huge crash with the dodge demon 170 charger in greenville peace